Well, at the core of supports for people with intellectual and developmental disabilities, first and foremost, are their families. And we have seen a very significant shift in how people with IDDD are supported over their lifetimes. Um, we have moved from an assumption of institutions to then moving to 24-7 residential. And the reality of it is, is that the vast majority of people with intellectual and developmental disabilities are living with families or supported by families if they're living in supported uh, other circumstances. And um, yet our, our thinking in terms of the systems and the resources and how we're going to make sure that those families are working um, haven't shifted with that paradigm. Um, and the investments haven't continued to keep up with the demand and the need um, as it relates to families.